you are saying that the EC has made a position, has taken a position, and that we have taken a contrary position. Yeah. I think the job of the media is to serve as a referee. So the EC has put some information out. We have put contrary information out. We are all taking our information from public records. In fact, it's the EC that has not provided any public record. For instance, they have not provided a single biometric audit, a single equipment audit. In fact, when the Auditor General goes to the EC and, and does the normal audit and you read their report about the EC, they say that the EC has never had a proper asset register that is up to date and is compliant with best practices since it was set up. So think of it. Every year, we spend millions of dollars. We spent almost $250 million or something like that in the last couple of years, decade and a half, buying equipment. When was the last time you heard the EC doing an auction that, oh, these uh, um, cameras and these printers, they are a bit old, so we are buying new ones. These second-hand people come and collect it and, and go and use it. When was that time you saw the EC do an auction? So we have to start asking ourselves hard questions. Where is that? Where are those equipment? You bought equipment in 2018. You said they are no longer good. Where are the equipment? Where are they going to go? All the ones that you've been buying the previous period that you've been replacing, where have they been going? Those questions cannot be from civil society alone. The press must get interested. So my simple answer is, very, is this. The UC has said one thing. We have said uh, another thing. But we've given conclusive evidence from parliamentary records, from the Auditor General's own account. And we've also given you logical accounts. They are buying this equipment every year. When was the last time they disposed of any of them through auctions? So what the media now has to do is to become the referee. You have to say, okay, this is the data. This is where they say they got it from. What are you saying? Because I don't think we can just say that because the EC says this and Imani says this, we are lost. No, I think as media people, you are empowered. You are more than officers of the court of public opinion. As far as I'm concerned, you constitute the court of public opinion in the first instance. It is your job to say, we've heard you, we've heard them, but you have concrete evidence that you bought this equipment not too long ago. Why are you throwing them away for a new one? I don't think it's that difficult.